Well, <laughs> look at you. I know. I dress like a banana. Just like a banana. <laughs> We've peeled that banana and the inside has gone bad, okay? No. Well, you know, if you're going to be a banana, you got to no, go all I'm the a, way. No, I'm a fresh, firm, ready-to-eat banana. <laughs> I can, there, there are two or three lines yeah, don't, circulating don't. right now. <laughs> I can't say anything without you going there. Yeah, well, I, I can't help it. I know. know. I, I it's was, what's it's, charming it's about up, you. my upbringing, okay? <laughs> All those years of television where we did stuff like that, you know? I don't do it anymore. You I were just, great on television. Yeah, I was. Mm -hmm. yeah, I enjoyed it. That's because I enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah. I didn't enjoy being um, known publicly. No, you didn't. I, did, I didn't. You do. You I enjoy do. that. Very much. I, I didn't. Well, I love people. Well, you love people too, I love but people, I love them. Yeah, yeah. I love to be friendly. Yeah. Anyway, here we are again. Oh, I meant not to drink. Okay, yeah, well, that actually, that color goes very nicely with your yellow. Mm -hmm. And you look beautiful. beautiful. Wow, is that good? I always forget how great Cut Me New Shakes are. We have one every morning, and that's how I get all my vitamins down, and I don't even notice that I'm taking vitamins. But then when I have one midday like this, which I don't usually... Man, is that good? That's like having a chocolate milkshake. Yeah. And, you know, if you have one of those um, forms for making popsicles, great for making popsicles. Have you done it? No. I haven't either. No. So I don't know if I it have. works. Have you? They're good. Oh, yeah, really? They're great. A gut renews oh, yeah. po popsicle? Yeah. Huh. Yeah, you just get little, you know, molds and great for like the fruit. Flavored hmm. ones or the what any any of the flavors. Huh. Yeah, you know those those stores that sell pots and pans, they they carry that. Let's go to that store because we've got one of those down the street here. Okay. Let's go to the, that. There's stuff I want, and I don't know what hey, I want. Hey, you guys, Grandma Eleven Eleven on Instagram lost twenty one pounds with the help of Gutman. Hey, wow. Grandma. Wow. Wow, how great, and how great for your health. You know, when people lose weight, I've often wondered when they talk about, you know, losing a lot of pounds, I wonder where they go. You know, it's like on, online, when you, when you uh, delete something, where does it go? It, it's got to go somewhere, right? Where does it go? Where do those pounds go? When you delete on your phone, you delete it forever? Well, as far as you're concerned, but it's got to go somewhere. Where does it go? Well, usually it goes to trash. Yeah. But then you delete it from trash. Yeah, I go through it all day long, going trash, 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 trash. Yeah, where does it, where does it go? I don't well, you know. You got where. rid of how many? 13,000 of those yeah. of mine yesterday? Yeah, you had 13,000 of them. Yeah. And then a sign came up that said, you can't send any more emails because your mailbox is full. And again, I thought, hold it. Why do we need a mailbox if you're sending mail out? Huh? Well, that's for when you save, right? No, you wanted to send an email, yeah. and you showed me the little sign on the screen yeah. that said, you, we're not going to send this out because your mailbox is full. Mm. And I thought, we're not accepting an email, we're sending an email. You know what? Remember how easy it was to write something on a piece of paper, stick it in an envelope, and put a stamp on it and say Called goodbye? Called a letter? <laughs> this is old fart talk, right? <laughs> I think when our house burned down, the thing that I missed the most, I had some amazing letters. I had letter, letters from uh, President Reagan and Barbara Walters, and I can't remember now who, but I, I, every time I got a letter from someone of note, I'd put it in a file, and I was gonna do something with it. I, don't, I never knew what I was gonna do with it. And then when the house burned down, I, I remember standing in front of the house, watching it burn down, thinking of those letters of, oh, darn it. And you had, you had uh, at least two letters from Bush the Elder. Oh, yeah, my boyfriend. Yeah, that's right. And you sang one, I remember one year, you were on stage in Las Vegas. Yeah. And it was a full house. Right. And it was George Bush Sr.'s birthday. 
Yes. And you had the entire audience sing yes. Happy Birthday. Remember how he loved? He loved it. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. And then you had. Hey, you... I'm ch just I'm just interjecting with comments as I see them. I'm, I'm not trying to to ruin your stories, but these are chocoholic. Just said. Gut Renew has helped my stomach issues so much. I've never had my stomach feel this good. No bloating, pain, and cramping. I love Gut Renew. I'm so wow. happy to hear that. That's so great. Well, then it's time. That's my cue. To? Okay, because I wear many hats on the show. All right, while you, while you take your cue, I'm going to okay. drink the uh, Gut Renew okay. shake. It's so good. Okay, this is a Gut Renew deal of a lifetime, okay? It's the original value size superfood. Let's hold this up. Yeah. Or I'll hold it up. There it is. Okay. And it provides 30 servings. That's yeah. three O servings. We have a box of snack bars. We have the peanut butter crisp and the box of snack bars of banana bread. Now it's listen so carefully good. to the this. So good. The retail value is $217.97. It's on sale for 41% off at $129.98, free shipping and handling, okay? 41% off. If you're a gut renewer, this is your moment. If you're not, this is a great way to try it. And, and yeah, and also guys, if this is, it's really like getting a free box of bars for free. Um, and, These are great. You know, we discount, you know, we discount the value size bag to ninety nine ninety nine, and we discount the bars to twenty nine ninety nine. But even with those discounts, it's still like getting a box of bars for free. And we're giving you the opportunity to lock in this price on subscription. So if you love Gut Renew and you love the bars, this is a smoking good deal. What a great, you know, midday when you just like are starving. Grab one of these. You won't do any harm. Yeah. And you'll only do good. And it's not like having a gut renewed shake, but it has a lot of the same components. I, I love the whole idea of gut renew and what it does. Well, it has the same components, but not as many of them. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, I just made that yeah. up. Yeah. And there was your, uh, your bar wouldn't taste that good if we got that much gut renew in there. No. No. Because it's small. It's, you know, the, the bars are, I mean, it's just, it's a wonderful snack. I I also have it as dessert. To me, that's what keeps me away from sugar. Okay, you're yeah, watching, you you're watching that. Chrissy Snow opening a bar here. Okay, she's the female version of Larry David when it comes to opening things in plastic. <laughs> ha, 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 ha. I did it. I did it. And we've been binging on Larry I was going to say King, Larry David, for the past few, actually for the past week. Maybe even two weeks. It's You know what? The thing is, we were watching dramatic stuff before we went to bed. So it was hard going to sleep. And if we woke up in the middle of the night, it was hard mm. getting back to sleep good, mm. huh? Yeah. This is good. Mm. Well, let me tell you about Debbie Williams. Okay. Um, on Facebook, she said, I've been on Gut Renew for three weeks. I'm having my shake now, and I have never felt so good in my life. Stopped oh. my meds for my bowels. My doctor was so happy. I showed him everything I'm on and ordered the colon vitamins, which she's talking about colon renew. I can't say how happy I am. No cramping, no bloating. I've lost 26 pounds. Ooh. Wow. Yahoo. Love all your products. Wow. From rural farmland, Alberta, Canada. And her okay. name is Debbie? Debbie Williams. Hey, Debbie, I'm so happy for you. I let you know I love <clears throat> bringing you products. I call it doing well while doing good. And when I hear this, I think you're, you're doing good with this product and um, it's a win-win for everybody. I know when we reorder Gut Renew, it's phenomenal. Tons, tons and tons of this Gut Renew powder and we because have, we everyone actually, is responding yeah, so It fills positively. up our entire living room, okay? <laughs> and we, we work all night packaging it. <laughs> and sweeping. Oh. I'm so tired yeah. of sweeping. <laughs> well, you look particularly beautiful this evening. Well, you like me as a banana. I, 
I've got a couple of lines right now. <laughs> <laughs> And we are, we're going out for dinner this evening yes, we are. with some of your friends, and we're going to be eating outside. Yes. And you're dressed for it. Let me see. I am. Let me see what the weather is going to and be And when it's tonight. cold here, it's colder than where you live. Okay, so right now it's 68 degrees and sunny, okay? Oh. However, tonight it's going down to 44 degrees. Oh, that's cold up here in 44. the mountains of the desert. I mean, that's cold. you know, where I where I used to where I used to live from where I was born in, in Canada in Toronto. Where was that, Al? 44 Toronto. Uh -huh. 44 degrees was like a walk in the park, okay? But 44 degrees in the desert when you've lived here for years and your blood is thin. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. yeah. But we're ready. Mm -hmm. you, you're dressed like a banana. Did you bring a sock hat? I have a big quilted black coat. Oh. That has a hood. I'm going to be so warm. Hey, here? Suzanne, Virginia likes your nail polish. Um, do you know what color you have on today? I have the, two, the, the pink slip. And what's the other pink we have? Get, get naked and pink Yeah, slip. those are the two on okay. top of one another. And I happen. It looks to be, good. I have short nails right now, but it looks good, doesn't it? Yeah, I happen to be. Great. I happen to be wearing pool. It's a little out of season. Yeah, he doesn't want to wear pool right now anymore. But it still looks good on you. I know. You live in Palm Springs. Yeah. It's yeah. Yeah. It's on brand. Yep. Look at this. Can you see that weather? Unbelievable. Okay. What weather? Well, I'm just showing everyone the weather in Palm Springs. Oh, the, going down oh. to 40. But you should see the mountains all around us. They're covered. Yep. Thick with snow. It's yep. so beautiful. Yeah. You know, when we first moved here, I used to love with the whole all the kids. I used to love we'd, we'd be swimming, then we'd go up into the mountains and play in the snow, and then come back and hop back into the pool. It was great. Yeah. The the um, we were over at our new house the house we never seem to move into. And um, they're putting the carpets in today and the coffee table arrives tomorrow. And then these sofas that we had recovered for there are also today, once the carpets, carpets are in, then they're gonna be put in their places. I think the next time we go there, we'll really see the potential of what, how we're going to live. Well, and not the potential. It's going to be pretty much done. Yeah. I yeah. Mean, there are... I, I have these dreams. Like I was dreaming last night. You know all these supplements we have in the office bathroom? Mm-hmm. We packed them all up, all of them, and then we went into our bathroom of the new house, and we have cabinets when you go around the corner, and... Um, it was filled with all the vitamins, and I, I, I woke up feeling, ha, ah, okay, well, that's done. <laughs> yeah, I don't have dreams like that. I know, I'm, my dreams are... Um, Your dreams are, what are we going to cook for dinner? Yeah, I yeah. dream that all the time. I know you do. Yeah. yeah, and I think about it all the time. You know when I wake up in the morning, once I'm up for a little while, I start thinking about dinner. I know that. And uh, getting dinner ready for the night. Yep. Like tonight, we're not having dinner because we're going out. And it's weird to me to not make dinner. And, and Violet, our granddaughter, um, her boyfriend, who I really like, uh, it's his birthday tonight, so Caroline's cooking dinner for him. I am, I am. I kind of cooked it yesterday. That's what, I, that's what I'm doing. Do I'm giving a dinner today. party Friday night for 18 people. And um, I'm doing uh, a very special uh, pasta sauce. And uh, I made one batch today. I'm going to make another batch tomorrow and then another one Friday. So that by Saturday, the night of the party, that it's all done, really. We just make a salad. And we want to do the... Um, Chocolate pot de creme. I love that. Yeah. So if you've just joined us and you don't know what the great big deal is today, it's the gut renew deal. Yeah. Okay. You get Tell them what's free first. Okay. 
you get the original, there it is right here. Yes. That's the value size superfood, and uh, it has 30 servings, okay? And uh, you're getting the peanut butter crisp snack bar and the banana bread snack bar. Yeah, and the retail value is $217.97. So Right. It's 41% off at one twenty nine ninety eight, free shipping and handling. Good one. Mm, yum. Is that the uh, peanut or the banana bread? Um, it doesn't matter to me. Peanut. Peanut. Want some? I'm, I'm going to try the banana bread tonight. Okay. I like both of them. I, I, first, I first fell in love They're with both the... They're great. ...with the uh, peanut, because um, I like nuts. And then I've come around to really like the banana bread. You know what I've noticed about Alan? He's so healthy. Every test he takes comes back A+. Plus. He's so healthy. Well, it's... And I've been noticing, not noticing, I've noticed over the years, he eats an enormous amount of fruit and a tremendous amount of nuts. He's just not happy unless he has a bowl of nuts in front of him, and he's always munching on some on some fruit. And yesterday, you'll be surprised to know, we went to Costco. Yep. Yeah, and that, that's where Alan is in his happy place. And he bought how many mangoes? 36, 36 honey mangoes. Oh, those are the really And then yummy six kind. of the, the round ones. Yeah, the other ones. I don't know what they're called. And then you bought all those avocados, which were perfect. Yep, I bought and, uh, 15 avocados. And then you, all those beautiful lemons. Oh, yeah, Meyer lemons. Yeah. I wonder if there was a guy by the name of Meyer who invented that, right? Meyer, what are you doing? I'm inventing <laughs> a lemon. <laughs> really? Meyer lemons are different from regular lemons because the skin is so thin on them. That's why they don't sell them in stores because they, they don't last long. They too fast. But when you, you know when you go to squeeze a lemon, sometimes you really have to use a lot of pressure, not with a Meyer lemon. Cut it in half and go, and it just juices it up. It's so good. And the flavor is great. And last week we made chicken piccata, which is in a butter lemon garlic sauce and we sauteed the lemon slices. Remember how good they were? Mm. They were so good. They were almost like the lemons, they weren't sour, they were like candy. It was just fantastic. But last night, to know that. Yeah. for dinner, Yeah. Uh, in addition to the chicken, mm -hmm. which was delicious, yep. and the, the sauce, the gravy was incredible yeah. with the mashed potatoes. Yeah, that's a and great dinner. The fresh green beans, wonderful. Yeah. Okay, what Organic. was I about to say? Um, something Last important. Last night, lemons. We were talking about lemons. Oh no! So I had a, an a baked clove of garlic, not a clove. It's a, oh yeah. What are they? Not a clove. What do you call it when a, it's a whole, whole thing? Whole clove of garlic. You know, whole no, head of head. A head. Yeah. Okay. There was a baked head of garlic on my plate, so I ate the entire thing. He did. And uh, this morning, I was made aware of the fact that I had unbelievably bad garlic breath, <laughs> and uh, Suzanne didn't have any yeah. garlic on her dinner, which I thought she would have. That way, I we both have garlic bread. I usually do, and then when you both do it, you don't smell it on the other one. But That's true. Whew, yours was uh, strong. Yeah. You ate the whole thing. But then I thought, that's okay. Mm. Garlic is Good. so healthy. I can put it in your mouth from here. Mm. Mm. No. Mm. I'll have my gut renew shake, which is so good. Mm. Yeah, watch Feels it. so wrong to have a chocolate gut renew milkshake at the end of the day. Why? The one we make in the morning, um, I, I would... I always buy bananas, but when they're only good the first day, then the second day they start getting a little few brown spots, and then after that, you got to cut them up and put them in the freezer. So I have a whole plastic bin of of bananas that were just a little too over the hill to eat in their natural state. So I put them in the freezer while they still have flavor. So in the morning, I go in that bin and I take out about ten 
pieces of bananas, and that's your ice cubes. And I put that in the, in the blender. Then I put two scoops per each of us of Gut Renew. Then I put, with the banana, I put um, a spoon of the chocolate powder and sometimes I put a spoon of almond butter, which tastes really good in there. And then for the liquid, I use half and half, half coconut milk and half chocolate almond milk. Whip it up and fill one of these Gut Renew um, uh, cups. And by the way, this cup is so great. I use it for so many things. And um, Man, is that good. And if you take supplements, I take a lot of supplements. And um, I never knew, they're all important. When I read about them or uh, write about them, every supplement I take is really important. But when you put it all together in the morning, it's a lot. But when you take it down with a Gut Renew uh, shake, it's, uh, it's painless. You know, I think uh, <clears throat> one day there are so many millions of people globally who love you because of that fabulous character you created on Three's Company called Chrissy Snow. She was darling. I think that one day on one of our Instagram and Facebook live shows, you should be Chrissy Snow. Hmm. That might be weird to not be me, but to be her. I love being her, but... Did Why? anybody see that in, in our, um, where is it, Facebook, Caroline, of Chrissy dancing with Sean Ritter? Oh, yeah, I posted it on uh, Facebook and Instagram. I, also, I, I have watched it like. 30 times or more. I love it because I remember, I remember doing that, and I remember the abandon that I danced with. The, the, the whole thing about Chrissy Snow was, you couldn't think of parameters. You have to. You had to do everything without any any thought of it. No parameters. And did did, did our friend Rusty do that? Yeah. Okay, I thought well, so. Well, and and Caroline. I think Caroline told him, you know, when to have them. You you worked with him in the music, right? Um, I I created, directed it. He executed it. So you're a good team. A very good partnership. Yeah, you're a good team. Because um, I just love it. I think it's magical. Where do they go to see it? It's on Instagram and Facebook. Okay. Go to Instagram and Facebook and watch Chrissy dancing. You will love it. I've been trying to send it to my brother and it won't go. Well, that's because your mailbox was full, remember? Oh, was that before you did all the uh, yeah. delete? Oh. I haven't tried it since, but oh. I assume that oh, it will go I'll try now. it later then. Okay. By the way, you know what I thought about I don't when know I saw Chrissy, Chrissy Snow dancing on that video? Yeah. Those were when boobs were real. <laughs> okay. Right. Yeah. Right. It always, it always was a sidebar in the script. And Chrissy jumps for joy. <laughs> and I knew what that meant. <laughs> you know what I did, though? Uh, I uh, gave away all my Three's Company scripts. Yeah, some university would have been happy to get them. Uh, they would have been so valuable. Not that I would have wanted the money for them, but it, um, I had all my notes in them and things that John would lean over and write and... We got along so great. So Stephanie Walton said, I'm getting away from all plastic. Yeah. And only using glass and uh, stainless steel. Good for you. Yeah. You know, the, the great thing about, what is that plastic called that, uh, that doesn't harm you, Caroline? Uh, you mean BPA free? Yeah. That's what I meant. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm okay, I'm okay with that. But I agree, I don't like, you know, so that uh, plastic uh, stuff you put over dishes when you're saving food. Oh, yeah. And it lays on the food in the refrigerator. I can't eat it after that. I know. Yeah, I have trouble with that. I know. He, <clears throat> he has, it's not finicky. He is um, finicky. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think, you know, I think. He has standards. Thank you. Yes, he has standards. Like I made veal scallopini the other night, and it was delicious. 
really delicious and made a great sauce. And um, after we finished it, he said, I can't eat veal anymore. I said, what? He said, the way they treat veal when they're making veal. What's that? The animal's not called veal. It's, it's a lamb, right? No, no, it's a baby cow. It's a baby cow. Oh, right, okay. Well, It's a calf. Well, I hope you enjoyed that dinner because it was so good and I can't ever make it again. Yeah. Well, and, and there, you know, fortunately, I mean, some people will never be comfortable eating eating it regardless, but the practices that they used to use are um, not the same. They, right. They've banned that. Oh, that's oh, not really? happening anymore? Yeah. It's, now, a, it is, it's a young cow, but... Um, but yeah. they don't hang it and... Like they used no, to. No, yeah, they, they used to put yeah. it in a, bo in a box. So now would you eat it if they're not abusing I, I'll the have animal? To, I'll have to investigate. Investigate, because it's such a great dinner. Yeah, I'll investigate. Wow. It's just amazing. I would have made that for dinner tomorrow night for 18 people, but I didn't want it's Too many people. Yeah. 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 Actually, we just, we should have ordered it in pizza. Maybe. You know? Maybe. You know all that caviar I bought for us as a family? And it, uh -huh. it was a big jar of it, and um, no occasion was ever good enough to open that big, big vat of caviar. Well, that was really the impetus for my dinner party uh, Saturday night. <laughs> That's where I can use all that caviar. <laughs> you know, we were spoiled with caviar because we have a friend. Uh -huh. And he did a lot of business uh, in the Middle East. And when he would return to L.A., he would return with uh, a gift from the president of one of these companies, uh, countries, and it was a giant bell jar filled with caviar. And he yeah. didn't care for caviar, so guess who got it? <laughs> that was fun. Yeah. Did we finish it? We did. We always did. Mm. Sure. Yeah, you become like, you know, a glutton. It was like that day when, um, what's that, the Greek guy who fell in love with you in Monte Carlo, what was his name? With the ship. Oh, Stavros Niarchos. Stavro, Stavros oh. Niarchos, yeah. He, oh, I, he, could, he could, I couldn't have married him, yeah, but we were, he could we have were, married yeah, me. We were, doing, we were doing a show in Monte Carlo, <laughs> and he came to the show. And then after the show, he uh, walked up to you, okay, <laughs> and he invited you to come for dinner aboard his ship. Now, it wasn't a yacht, it was a ship. Yeah, it was a big ship. Yeah, and you said, well, I, I'm here with 60 people, and he said, bring them. So we all went, and uh, I think he had a waiter for each person we brought. Yeah, yeah. And they all had these uh, huge bowls of caviar it was like it was decadent and when dinner time came he's like a crass guy and he like swats me goes come sit next to me and then he looks at al and he says you can bring whoever you want oh yeah i i, I could have been roadkill <laughs> on that trip and he looked at me with those eyes and well, I thought, there was talk yeah about prior wives and what happened to them yeah you know, I think people with that kind of um, money. Uh, well, I don't think we should categorize all people. With no, that no, kind no, of... no, no. Okay. I, some people. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe him. Maybe he's the only one. But I heard stories about him that scared me. But he probably I just like was... being with you, Al. I know. I'm safe with you. I know. I know. So I have to do this once more. Please do. You're good at it. Okay. That's I have what to do you this did for Alpha more. Beta. Yeah. That's right. Tell a friend. Yeah. Okay, this is our gut renew deal. You get the original value size superfood. There it is. 30 servings. Okay. Incred it's incredible. And you can make it any way you want. Like I do it with bananas and what I, the recipe I gave you, but you can you can Right. Open your freezer and look at your frozen fruit and start throwing it in, and you're going to be amazed. It's just delicious. In addition to the superfood protein formula, 30 servings, 
You get the peanut butter crisp box. You get the banana bread box. I think each one has 10 bars, right, Caroline? That's correct, Alan. Okay, the retail value is $217.97. <laughs> Sale today, $129.98. Free shipping and handling, 41% off at SuzanneSummers.com. Yay! That's it. It's really like getting a whole box of bars for free. You guys know, you know, the Gut Renew and the, and the bars, they're already discounted, so we rarely do any additional discount. So these three products, it's called the Free Bars Gut Renew Trio. You can lock in the price today and get it on subscription, but today's the only day. So order it if you want this deal and lock it in on subscription if you want that deal going forward. You know, the great thing about subscription, because the deal's going to be the same going forward, right, Caroline? Yes. Okay. Is you can cancel it anytime you like. You can cancel it 10, minute, 10 minutes after you make it. And we don't play games here, okay? We don't keep sending it to you. No. Because we personally have experienced that with other things online we have ordered. And I have to get on the phone. And you know, the three words <laughs> that they don't want to hear? Because they'll try to do anything. They'll say, well, I'll have to speak to my manager. Okay, speak to your manager. And they put me on hold for five minutes and they come back and say, Okay, well, the manager said we should give you another 18%. I said, I don't want this product, okay? I'm sending it back. You said I could send it back. Yeah, but it's a great deal. And that's when I pull out the three words. <laughs> the Better Business Bureau, okay? That's like a dagger in the heart of someone selling stuff online. And he said, okay, 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 okay. We'll, we'll, we'll be credit crediting your account. So just remember, Better Business Bureau. Well, it worked. Oh, no, it didn't. You've been trying to get that drawer for that desk you ordered. Yeah, but I didn't go to the Better Business Bureau. I almost did. This but is... why didn't you? They have not sent you your drawer. You ordered it in October. Because they were pathetic. We ordered these desks last October, and the guy's yeah. going to finish up putting them together next week. Next week. Okay. Since October. Since last October. Yeah. Next week is, Feb is February. Yeah. The guy's coming February the 1st to finish. Oh, he is coming? Yeah. Oh. Well, they say. Oh. They say. Okay. I'm anxious to put our office together. Yeah. This will be, be my first real office I've ever had. I mean, I have an office in my... No, I don't have no, an office. No, you have an office. It's called uh, your bed. No, I... <laughs> he sits in bed all day and just sits there with his laptop. I, I, you know, I, I used to have a, a, a room, an office in my office. But I, I no longer have it because I, I, I don't use it. Okay? Aww. And it's not... Yeah, you know. Aww. And it's not that it, it has people I don't want to see because I like all the people in our office. It's that I don't work well in an office, mm. okay? Because when I'm working in an office and uh, the FedEx guy comes in, he says, oh, Mr. Hamill, how's the missus? So I have that conversation. And then, uh, you know, whoops, excuse me. And then there are a number of things that distract me, and I, I get distracted easily. So I find working alone in my bed with no distractions works best for me. But now... In our new house, we have a real office, and it's also our gym. We'll have a treadmill there and a rowing machine, and my little workout tools that I have that I share You're every so often. You're in such great shape. Well, I... He doesn't um, have a set routine, but he has these, these uh, like the thigh master is one of them, and the butt master is one of them, and the oyo is another one. And, you know, when you pull these tight um, wires out, you really get this, his biceps impress people. But also, you have, you have a smaller version of one of my tools that you use, and uh, it's great. I love it. I it's use great. it. I maybe I use it maybe six times a day. Wouldn't you say? Yeah, and it's all your you know your chest muscles. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it, it you know the word perky comes to mind. <laughs> perky. Okay. You're so sweet. <laughs> you use this. Use this for a while. 
you'll notice perky. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then we try to walk every day because walking is an issue for me. And we try to walk. Yeah. And Alan's so sweet. He, he puts a black support belt around my waist and he holds me from the back so that if I lose my balance, which it's getting a little better and a little better and a little better, but I can't wait for that balance issue to resolve itself. Actually, I don't hold you. I just have my fingers under the belt loosely because yeah, I don't true. want to hold you. Yeah. They're there. My fingers are there in the event you should lose your balance. Okay. All yeah. right. Well, I think we've come to the horn here. We've rounded the horn. <laughs> and it's yeah, time it's, to it's say about 22. Auf Wiedersehen. Yeah. Okay. I, I, I love this time with all of you. And I, I'm going to say what I say at the end of every show because it, Imagine being talked to, a voice from where? And this voice said to me, it's not who you are, it's not what you do, it's not what you have. It's only about who you love and who loves you. And I love you. Good night, everybody.